Welcome back to Checkpoint. My name is Blake Chapman. And my name is Jeremy Rogers. As we've seen with the past half decade, award season wouldn't be the same without a firestorm of surprise nominations, egregious omissions, and general controversy to boot. As the Academy Awards announced their selections for this year's awards show on Tuesday, the choices were destined to be scrutinized and argued. And this seems like one for the record books in more ways than one. The conversation begins with the nomination of the third highest grossing film in the U.S. in 2018 Marvel sensation Black Panther. Ryan Coogler's $700 million juggernaut was the first film in the superhero or comic book genre to receive a Best Picture nomination. Nice. Right? The film has already received nominations from the Golden Globes to the Screen Actors Guild and has also received Oscar nods ranging from everything from costume design to the original score. Well, the controversy comes into play when considering if the nomination is deserved for its creative talent as a motion picture or simply because of its impressive cultural messages when it came to black representation in film. Critics have been keen to point out that other notable superhero movies in years past were unjustly skipped over when it came to the main category, such as Christopher Nolan's The Dark Knight and James Mangold's Logan. Some say this could represent the shifting of Oscar recognition to be more about a movie's social impact over its other values. However, if you also consider the factor Coogler himself was omitted from the race for best director and screenplay, the best picture shine sort of rubs off. Not a fan of that. Uh, in other notable Oscar news, A Star is Born was snubbed from the nomination list for Best Director under Bradley Cooper. Netflix won big on Tuesday, landing a Best Picture nomination for the drama Roma, following a maid living in Mexico City in the early 1970s. Roma also received recognition for lead and supporting actress. Uh, the Mr. Rogers documentary, Won't You Be My Neighbor, was another seemingly big favorite left out of the other top contenders, though. So, what do you guys think? Will these omissions further cause Oscar viewership to decline? Does Black Panther's Best Picture nomination truly give the movie justice, or does it come off as pretentious? Let us know you, your opinion down in the comments below. For all your entertainment, tech, and pop culture news, be sure to subscribe to Byte BSU and stay up to date with us on Checkpoint. If Into the Spider-Verse does not win Best Animated Movie of the Year, Disney has legitimately bought that award. Out of the last 10 years, Disney has won nine out of those 10 awards. Give my man Miles a chance.